Closely related to the fill method is the tabulate method. In many ways it's very similar, except that the second argument that it takes is not a pass by name argument, instead it's actually a function. Because one of the limitations of the fill method is the fact that when you are filling in the values, each one doesn't know where it goes in the array or the list. With tabulate you pass in a function, and that function has its input as the index. And so it, each element can be calculated based upon that index. We can illustrate this making an array. We'll call tabulate. We can have it with 10 values. And using the rocket syntax, we can say i for the index. Well, I could just make a simple one that says i, in which case I get the array 0 through 9, because those are the indices. If I had said i plus 1, I would have got, gotten the values 1 through 10. If I had said i times 2, I would get 0 through 18. And so hopefully that gives you a feel for how the tabulate method works. We can do the same thing for lists. And of course, for situations like this, we don't have to use the rocket notation we can use the shorter underscore notation. Technically anything that we could have done with fill we could do with tabulate if we simply ignore the argument that's passed in. It's just a more verbose approach. It should also be more clear from this one why when we do something like that we get 10 distinct values because here this function is going to be called 10 times and each time that it's called we get back a different random number. If I wanted to fill my list with the squares of the indices I could do something like that. Okay so the tabulate method is a close relative to fill. It does something very similar. It gives us back a new collection and because we're able to pass in the size, it's very easy for us to make very large collections. But its argument, its second argument, is a function. And so we have information about where it's located in the array or the list. And we can make the values vary based upon their positions.